How's it going, everybody? My name's Sugarcat. I know what you're thinking to yourself. Sugar, I got $500, but I don't got a lot of time to get my portrait done. A beautiful portrait of this spectacular face. Well, you've come to the right place. Welcome to Sugarcat's 90 second portraits, where we charge a fortune. And I can't promise you it will be bad, but I can promise you it will be good. Look at that skill. Just look at it. Look at it! It's amazing! We're gonna go through the tutorial just to make sure that we're, uh, we're not too rusty. It's been a bit a couple hours since I've painted a masterpiece. Time is money, and you have neither. In 90 second portraits, you're paying the bills by speed painting portraits of bypassing customers. Pa 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 pa! You have 90 seconds to paint the customer in his or her preferred background image and the background image. Plenty of time. Your workday ends after five customers. Your task is to paint whatever is inside the red lines, character and background, to the best of your abilities. This looks like olive oil. Oh, I need olive oil. That's the best Popeye impression I got, sorry. When your timer bar depletes, you'll be forced to service the next customer. Alternatively, hitting the next button will finish your current painting. Bucket. Click to lock reticule, then drag and release to increase the intensity of your throw. Whoa to enter the color mixing module, hit the button mix and then click the color you wish to replicate. That's uh I'm a perfect master of blending colors together to get what I want. Um, especially if it's brown. I'm really good at making brown. At the end of your workday, after servicing five customers, you will receive a total score tallied from the individual scores of the paintings. Ending a painting before the timer runs out adds a score multiplier. Good luck. I won't need it. I'm absolutely fine. Just a regular old Da Vinci. Start working. Oh, you... Mm, okay, we need... Mix. We need white and black. Yeah, he's, that's yeah, that's exactly what he is. Uh, he has a big football-shaped head. That looks fine. We need some black for your lovely arms, sir. Oh my God! Um, blue for his pantaloons, and I did not leave myself enough space for his pantaloons. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> need some yellow. Need some yellow. Uh, 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 uh. Uh, you don't require ears, do you, sir? Sure. Let's give you some nice. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Look how beautiful you are. I didn't fill in your shirt. You're shirtless because you're so masculine. He has no color in his face. That's fine. That's fine. You just need a little bit of sun, sir. That's all. I kind of. Blotted out your eye, but it's fine. He gave me three bucks. That was better than I was expecting. Oh my god, it's an angry dinosaur. Oh, it started up right away. Um, uh, okay, it's everything in the X. So we don't have to paint what's inside. I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. I'm not even speaking the English. Uh, okay, there we go. There we go. Oh, I got a paint bucket. Bloop, bloop. Okay, that's not really working. We're just gonna fill it in manually. My paint bucket appears to have technical issues, and it has made a bit of a mess. Uh, he needs little beady eyes, boop, boop, and a big smiley face. And you need some pink, because of your lovely pink hair, sir, dinosaur, ma'am. Oh my Jesus. Um, <laughs> uh, it could be a bit darker. I apologize for the uh, the light and skin tone, but you know it's winter. Not a lot of dinosaurs are getting their sun that they need, and you need a thinner brush. And you're very, very angry today. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. Astounding. I'm gonna round out your nice features here. There we go. It's a B. It couldn't be any better. Ooh. Excuse me, sir. You seem to have misplaced something, namely your pants. Um, oh boy, your your anatomical features are certainly uh, very good, sir. I mean, come on. I mean, I wish I could have a body like this. Oh boy, yeah, yeah, this uh, this noodle look really is in these days. There we go. I mean, it's, it's a lot lighter than I would like, but that's fine. That's fine. This is our skin tone that we're going with. We've chosen this because it's the only paint that we have in stock today. They were out of pink paint at the store. So there's not a whole lot I could do. Am I drawing your dong? Um, there. Um, you got a nice, pretty face going on here. We need some white. 
with some teeth. It's not showing up. That's fine. That's absolutely fine. We're going to draw your nice uh, decorations that you got going on here. Okay, now you need a big old smiley face. <laughs> Wait, you're supposed to draw the background too? How the hell are you supposed to do that? Wow. Okay. <laughs> oh no. Okay. Ah! I got it. I got it now. You drag it. You drag the bucket. Okay. Now we got some. St oh god. Uh, we got some. Boop, 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 boop. We got some stars. Now we need some lovely, 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 lovely green. Uh, and he has a big tube head. It's fine. Yeah. Okay. And we're gonna fill this in as quickly as possible because apparently customers are a little bit more greedy than what I expected. They're demanding a lot from a master artist. Boop, boop, um, boop. Okay, and now we gotta deal with the most important aspect, which is the moon. The moon is in the background, and it needs to be colored in, because this dinosaur clearly took a vacation to the moon and he wants to remember, and the best way to remember is to come to Sugar Cat's Magic 90 Second Portraits and get your portrait done. Look at that. Look at the skill. I might even have time to do some of that flag in the background. I just deleted my mix. Okay, I don't have time to do the flag in the background. That's fine. I got a B for it. That's amazing. Okay, this is a bluish. We're gonna get some paint on the background to get some background going. We're going to draw this building -y thing here, and we're going to draw the next building -y thing in the background, like a big dildo rocket by the looks of it. That's fine. That's fine. How are we going to draw him in the foreground? I have no idea. He's going to be right here. I don't know what I've done. But <laughs> um, okay, we're just going to go with it. We're going to go with it. Um, he has big, round, chubby cheeks. We're gonna assume that the background is gonna be invisible now because my proportion skills are something to be desired. And by something, I mean awesome. Look at that, look at that. It looks just like you! Kinda. Um, is that a mustache? No, no, it's not a mustache. It is a briefcase of some kind. We're going to draw that right in front of your face with its little handle. Look at that. Striking resemblance. I, if I close my eyes, I can't even tell. It's the same person. Total earnings, 15 bucks on day one. Look at that. Look at that. That is a master painting. Couldn't even tell. That's clearly the same person, except for the sun in the background is missing. I didn't have any background done on any of them. It's fine. It's fine. This guy looks like a bowling pin with two pink sausages sticking out of his ears. What are these? What are these? What have I done? This is, this is, mwah, this is perfect. This is perfect. And that, look at that. Look at that. My skill clearly increased from its slightly rusty point as we were going. And that has been 90 Second Portraits at Sugar Cat's Magical Portrait Emporium. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you hit that like subscribe button down below. The support means the world to me. It keeps me going. It keeps all this going. Keep being amazing guys. Keep being awesome. And I will see you all in the next video.